Hi, it's Dave, it's Stable Vehicle Contracts. Hope you're doing okay. So we did a video a couple of weeks ago about the Golf R in white silver. And we've got a lot of people in the comment section saying, basically disagreeing with me, which is just wrong. But anyway, uh, disagreeing with me saying that Indian grey is the colour to have in the Golf R hatch or estate. So what we've done today is we've lined up an Indian grey Golf R estate and what was a pure white Golf R estate but now it's like a dirty white Golf R estate because Phil can't, can't be arsed cleaning his car because yeah. you're lazy. Yeah. So um, first things first, I'm going to give a little bit of a shout out to a couple of the people, there was quite a few but picked out a couple of names of uh, people who commented saying that Indian grey was the better colour. So. They are uh, David Goldfield, Joe Summers, Rory McPherson, Simon Smith, and there was a load more. So thanks everyone for commenting. As always, we really appreciate that. So keep commenting, commenting, keep telling us what you think, what your opinions are, if you agree with us or not, uh, and we'll keep doing these videos. So we're going to do a bit of a walk around the car, um, but to settle this in the only true way we can, there's only one way we can settle this on YouTube, and that is through a poll. So in the top right hand corner of your screen, there's going to be a little eye. If you click on that, you can vote. If you would prefer the Indian grey or Phil's dirty white, pure white car in the Golf R range. So let us know. Use that um, little eye up there. So let's have a little look around this Indian grey Golf R estate and uh, let's see what we think. So first things first is the cost of it because there is um, a significant difference in the cost between the pure white and the Indian grey. Pure white's free, that's why you took it, isn't it, Phil? Yep. It's your cheapskate. Yep. And the Indian Grey's £570 cost option. And if you're leasing, just to give you an idea, that equates to roughly between £18 and £20 on a two year lease. So this car would cost you about £18 to £20 more than that car. Okay. Um, one thing that you noticed, Phil, actually, was um, you like these. Uh, this, the, the black look uh, against the grey there, like sort of quite a subtle yeah. um, look compared yeah. to yours. It's quite standout, -ish, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I think I prefer the pure white. If I'm dead honest. Yeah. Um, I've said when we walked on the P one of the PDI centres the other week that I wasn't didn't particularly like the Indian grey. Um, I still don't. Not in the estate version anyway. I think it looks a lot better uh, on the on the smaller um, golf spot in the estate. It's just I think it's too big a car this colour but that's just me personally but one thing I would do if I was going to be going for an Indian grey is I'd upgrade the wheels and I don't normally say I do that but I would I'd upgrade these to the 19 inch uh, uh, Pretoria black alloys uh, which is a 990 pound option but I think the look of those black wheels against the grey and then you know alongside all these little black um, uh, features as well works really well so that's something I'd definitely do. So that was just a very short video on the uh, comparing the Golf R estate in Indian Grey and Pure White. Don't forget to have your say. Let us know which you which colour you prefer. I'm probably you know I'm definitely sticking with Pure White. Phil, what are you saying? Pure White when yeah. it's clean. When it's clean, you need to sort that out. Yeah. Because that is manky. <laughs> yeah. Definitely sort that out. So yeah, definitely have your say. Let us know what you think, and we'll let, we'll let you know what the results are. Thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have. Give us a like, share, don't forget to subscribe if you don't already. And you need to check us out on Instagram if you don't already do that. We are at Stable Lease, it's just there. Go and give us a follow. Thanks for watching, see you again soon. Mm -hmm.